so today I am doing a little kind of, I don't even know what this is called, a tag or something, and it is going to be a collab with Lauren Claire. I don't know if you guys have heard of her, she's pretty, pretty new to the YouTube world, but she's really, really, really pretty, she's really good at what she does. I've watched most of her videos, and she's really good at it, and I really enjoy watching her, so I think that you guys would enjoy her too. I'd love if you would go over to her channel and give her some support by subscribing and checking out some of her videos. I will leave her video and her channel link in the description box below so you can go check out what her top 5 beauty products are for under $5. We decided to do this because we thought it would be a really fun video and you know everyone has a different products that they really like especially for that cheap so it's always great to learn new things and you can find new things that are really affordable. If you are coming over from Lauren's channel, then hi and welcome. I really hope you guys enjoy my video and let's get started. So my first product I'm going to talk about is something I've talked about quite a bit in my on my channel and it is the Batiste Dry Shampoo in the Dark and Deep Brown. It has a really tiny hint of color in it, so if you're blonde you can still use this. It just doesn't leave any white cast. I use it pretty much every single time I don't wash my hair and it's amazing. It, it works better than baby powder, which is what I always used to use. It works better than anything I've ever tried before. I have a whole review on a bunch of dry shampoos before I tried this one. The original one in this, that's in like the green and blue container, is not great. This one is amazing. It absorbs so much oil, gives you so much volume, and it smells like heaven. Oh my god, it's literally like a mix of perfume and chocolate together. If you've heard me talk about this before, you know that I love it. I wish that they made a perfume in this scent. It literally smells so good. It's only $4.99. It can be cheaper, so I haven't seen it ever for higher than $4.99. You can buy this actually at Ulta, and they always have it to buy one, get one 50% off, so it's always underneath $5, at least for me anyways. And it is just so, so amazing. I can't say enough good things about this. Like I said, it smells really good. It absorbs all the oils, gives you volume doesn't leave a white cast. There's really nothing bad about this. I love it. I recently discovered it, like I guess like I said, like two months ago or something, and I haven't been able to stop using it. I like, don't even want to wash my hair. I want to use this so bad. Like that's a big thing. So if you haven't tried this out, pick it up and in this color, no matter what hair color you have, it'll be fine. It just smells so good and it's just amazing. I don't think you'll regret buying it. Next I'm going on to skincare, and these are the Freeman face masks. These are just two of my favorite ones. I pretty much have tried almost every single one that they make. If you haven't heard of these, then I don't know where you have been living, but they sell them almost everywhere. Mostly I'd say Ulta and Harman's, a few other places I think too, but my two favorite ones at the moment are the Facial Clay Mask Chocolate and Strawberry. Literally smell like chocolate covered strawberries. It's like a really great mask I think for all skin types. Just kind of helps you with your T-zone and just like an extra cleansing. So you can really use this if you're any skin type. And then this this one is the Facial Polishing Mask Charcoal and Black Sugar. It's kind of like an exfoliant. It smells really sweet, kind of sweet smelling, and it's just kind of like more grainy and does kind of more of a exfoliating and moisturizing kind of effect. But these are my two favorite ones at the moment. I have an entire Freeman face mask review video and my favorite face mask videos, which a lot of these are in it. So I will link all my face mask kind of videos below. I even have my own face mask video, which I really like too, but I don't know if once you add up the ingredients of when you make it, if it's under $5. I'll leave that one below anyway if you want to check it out. But these are great. They're about $3.99. I haven't really seen them for more than that. I think they can go up to $4.99, but that's still under $5. They're always buy one get one half off too. They're really affordable. You get so much product in here. I haven't run out of any of mine, I don't think. They are so great, you can get them at the drugstore, and they just are fantastic. If you go to the Freeman website, they have a lot of other products too, but under their face masks you can look at all the ones they have, and I think it says where to find them too. It's pretty great, and I highly recommend these no matter what skin type you are, there's one for you out there. Also along the line of skincare is this lotion, and this is the Boots Expert Shine Control Lotion. You can only find this, I think, at Target. And this is really affordable. This is, I think, $3.99 or $4. I don't think it's more than $4. Um, it might be like $4.19 or something. But it is fantastic. This is my second one of these. And usually with moisturizers, I switch that up all the time. So it's shocking that I repurchased this after using it for almost a full year before it ran out. There is 3.3 fluid ounces in here. It has a nice little pump. And this is a great daytime moisturizing lotion. I have combo skin. It can get really dry and also get really, really oily. And this is fantastic. I use this every single morning. It doesn't have any kind of smell. It's really sensitive. It won't break you out. It won't kind of clog pores or anything. It's like the most light, thin kind of moisturizer you can use. If you have really dry skin, this probably isn't the one for you. My skin is like, usually really oily in my T-zone and it's so much better now that I've been using this. There's no, this line is really basic. It's like really basic ingredients. So none of the products are really gonna like blow you out of the water and be like your life changing product. But if you're someone with sensitive skin or you just kind of like the basics, then this line is really good for you. But this product itself did stand out to me just because it didn't irritate my skin, didn't make me too oily or too dry or anything. And it was really great. And it's just great for underneath your makeup for daily use. 
next two products are both makeup and one of them is my favorite foundation of all time and I just found it about, I don't know, like five, six months ago maybe and I did a full review on it and it is the Rimmel Match Perfection Foundation. This foundation is amazing. You can go check out my review if you want a really in-depth kind of like summary of what this foundation does and everything. I think this foundation is good for every single skin type. It has great coverage. I'd say medium to full. You can build it up without it looking too cakey. I am wearing it right now. It covers really well. It doesn't leave you feeling any like oily or like masky or anything. And it is $4.99, sometimes less depending on where you find it. If you find it like CVS or Walgreens, it's always going to be more there. But if you go to like Target or another kind of beauty store like that, it will be around $4, $4.99. I found it for as low as $2.99 when it was on sale. I'd highly recommend checking this out. Even if you don't like it, I mean, it's only $4. So you're really, like everything else here, you're not really losing a lot of money or anything. And most stores let you return things after you've opened them if you didn't like them. So really, really, really recommend these. Last but certainly not least is, these, are, is this product that I recently found literally like a week ago. And I'm obsessed with it. And it is the Milani Brilliant Shine Lip Glosses. They are amazing. I found mine at Walmart for the cheapest price. I think they were around $4. And oh my god, I am one of those people who am so picky with lip products. I don't like anything that I can feel on my lips. I don't want anything sticky, anything that's too high color, that's really high maintenance, so you have to touch up throughout the day. I just want something moisturizing, shiny, pretty, nothing too crazy. This lip gloss is to die for. I got mine in the shade Pink Lady 07, which is kind of like a blue toned pink, and the shade 09 Sweet Grapefruit, which is the one I am wearing right now. It's kind of more of like a just pure kind of pink shade. I love the packaging with the gold lids. I think it looks really nice and classy. They both smell really good. The more blue one smells more like vanilla icing, and the one I'm wearing right now smells kind of like the hot chocolate packet. If you know what I'm talking about, like when you buy like Swiss Miss hot chocolate and open that packet of powdered chocolate, that's what this smells like. Smell really good. They don't make my lips break out. My lips are super sensitive products. They're super, super hydrating. They feel so nice on the lips, but literally just like a chapstick or a lip balm or something. It doesn't give off too much like color you can use like, one thin layer and kind of really sheer it out or you can kind of build it up and get more full color so definitely try these out if you like a moisturizing lip gloss that doesn't feel too heavy or anything because these are fantastic so yeah those are my five products under five dollars these are ones i just kind of have been really standout products to me recently i definitely have more products i really like under five dollars as well it's kind of hard for me to narrow it down to five but if you want to hear more about those, then subscribe and you'll hear about them eventually. Or go back and watch my old videos and you'll hear about them. But these are the ones that have been standing out to me lately that I've just been really reaching for a lot. And I just thought well, you guys would be interested in knowing. If this wasn't enough for you and you want five more products, then definitely go check out Lauren, which I hope you do. So like I said, I will link her channel and her video below in the description box. So make sure you go and check that out. Also in the description box is all of the videos I mentioned in this video of mine. And all my social networks and stuff. So you can go and follow me on Instagram and Twitter and stuff like that. That is pretty much it for today's video. Really hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoy Lauren's video. I'm sure you will. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Sorry about your crazy hair. That's... <sighs> um, don't even know why I'm saying all this stuff. That's why I look tired. I feel like the bags are my eyes are like zombie eyes. <laughs> so hot in here. Oh my god.